The National Fire Protection Agency, 70E, is the standard for electrical safety in the work practice. I get a lot of people I talk to say, I don't want to sell clothing. Oh, I don't want to sell electrical safety. Oh, it's not. Uh, come on. Is it that big of a deal? Well, when we go to the task-specific chart in this book, if we just look at this one section here, it says panel boards or other equipment rated 200 volts and up to 600 volts. Work on energized electrical conductors and all circuit parts, including voltage testing. To voltage test at a panel rated 240 or greater, I need HRC2 clothing with rubber insulated gloves with tools. What does HRC2 clothing look like? I have to be dressed at a minimum in an AKL jumpsuit, hard hat face shield, balaclava, rubber insulating gloves with leather protectors. So the question I ask all the stores is this, is your customers are coming in and buying voltage detectors, they're buying meters, you sell a lot of fluke products, you sell a lot of Greenly, you sell a lot of Ideal. The question is, if you're selling them the testing equipment, why not the clothing to be worn when they have to test? And think about who tests out there. School districts have a lot of people walking around getting into the panels, HVAC techs, staff electricians. All industrial facil facilities will have staff electricians. Airports, sporting arenas, colleges, hospitals, they all have large electrical staffs maintenance staffs running around and they get into the panels. Was that a hospital of the other day? Well, we don't, we don't need that stuff. They have 14 guys into the panels. They all got to be dressed and they all got to be dressed at a minimum of this. So ask yourself whether you're a safety company selling safety clothing, whether you're an electrical distributor, maybe an industri industrial distributor, if you spent 40 years building relationships, building a customer base, why not offer them everything they need? Because trust me, it's the law. You have to be dressed. And if they can't get it from you, they will get it from one of your competitors down the street or go online. The question is, can we really afford to bleed off our customer base while they're going other places to get the, get the thing you should be selling. So, American Safety Clothing, we've been making this particular type of clothing for a very long time, 40 plus years. Grab, a, grab our catalog, take a look at what we offer, give us a call, we're very good at what we do, we can help you with this. We look forward to servicing you, we look forward to working with your customers, Use us for our expertise, for our innovation, and we'll use you for that for the for the, the time you spent building your customer base.